good friends we can Let's be. give it a try. Come on. Let's go, go, go. And we'll start a commotion. Set friendship in motion. Set friendship in motion. Set friendship in motion. Gordon goes to town. Vickerstown is one of the biggest stations on the island of Sodor. It's the station where lots of people travel by train from the mainland via the rolling bridge at Vickerstown. Sometimes, the engines that take trains from the mainland stay the night on Sodor and then go home the next day. One day, Gordon was at Vickerstown talking to one of these engines. When I was a young engine, I remember going to London. You know the place? The station's called King's Cross. King's Cross? London's Euston. Everybody knows that. Nonsense! London's Paddington. I know. I worked there when I used to work for the Great Western Railway. Gordon then went all around asking the other engines about the station name. Waterloo. St. Paul's. Farrington, Fenchurch. Lambeth. I really shouldn't be here. Silly things. I've no patience. Silly yourself. London's Paddington. Paddington, you hear? Stop arguing. You're not going to get anywhere with this bickering. You're both agreed about something anyway. What's that? London's not Houston. <laughs> I'm sure it's King's Cross. I'll go and prove it. But that was easier said than done. London lay beyond Vickerstown before entering the mainland via the bridge. Gordon had to stop at the station. Another engine then took the passengers away. Hmm, if I didn't stop, I could go to London. The next day, he tried to rush past the station. Gordon, what are you playing at? Ugh. Another time, he tried to start off again before the guard blew the whistle. He tried all sorts of tricks, but it was no use. His crew had checked him every time before heading home. Oh dear, I'll never get there. A few days later, he pulled into Vickerstown with the express as usual. Gordon and his crew waited and waited for the engine to arrive so that the passengers could travel to the mainland, but the engine never came. The engine was on his way with the passengers, but the points just before the station were jammed. <laughs> the station master had seen everything and he quickly ran to Gordon. Gordon, we have a situation here. The train that was meant to collect your passengers has just derailed and was supposed to take them to the station in London. I'll arrange something with Sir Topham Hatton a quick phone call. Stay put. The station master then returned with more news. Sir Topham Hatt says that you can take the train to London, Gordon. We've already gotten help to clear up the mess. Now hurry along. That sounds like a grand idea. We'll show them what Sir Topham Hatt's engines can do. Come on then, let's go. Gordon pulled out of the station with his train and then set off for London. Come on, come on, we're going to town. We're going to town. Gordon puffed past the Vickerstown Rolling Bridge proudly. He couldn't wait to get to London to find out the station name. The next day, Percy pulled into Napford with the mail train. Sir, I have a very important letter for you. Thank you, Percy. That'll do. Hmm, I wonder how Gordon's getting on. Honey, have you seen the news? Not yet. Why? Oh, my word! It's Gordon! 
And he's on the cover of London's newspaper. Famous engine at London station. Police call to control crowds. Sir Topham Hatt then read aloud to the other engines, and everyone was absorbed with the news. Gordon returned to Sodor the next day. The other engines and Sir Topham Hatt were pleased to see him home. I see you've had a good welcome in London. We certainly did, sir. We signed autographs till our arms ached, and Gordon had his photograph taken from so many directions that he didn't know where to look. Good. I expect he enjoyed himself, didn't you, Gordon? No, sir. I didn't. But why ever not? London's all wrong. They changed it. It isn't King's Cross anymore. It's St. Pancras. Yeah.